Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 29th. So keep in mind the timing is fluid. This could resonate at any time. Okay, so we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for around the 29th? Four of Wands. Four of Wands is about home, commitment, celebrations, get-togethers, having fun. This is like a bonfire of some sort. A gathering um, could be a picnic, a party, a get-together of some sort. Um, there could be planning. Somebody may be planning a party. There could be an upcoming celebration. There is an upcoming celebration of some sort, so get prepared. Get prepared. Get ready to hear news or get an invite. Somebody may get an invite to some sort of get-together. Three of Pentacles. This is the get-together as well. This is working together. Teamwork. It's interesting because there's four people in this card. Typically there's not. Anyway, um... And there's a four here. Anyway, this is a three. I just have never seen four people on a three of pentacles, so that's interesting. Anyhow, um, I just caught my eye. This is teamwork, togetherness, communication, compromise, appreciation. So there's going to be somebody. Looks like somebody is going to be creating something. A lot of people are watching watching intently somebody's going to be watching somebody uh, work or something like that they may be appreciating another person's work at this celebration there could be some sort of appreciation or something like that respect ten of wands now this is somebody that is overwhelmed Overwhelmed. This is this is carrying a heavy burden. Um, has a lot of weight on their back. Struggling, struggling to keep going. This is a little bit too much. So this is a little bit too much. Needs to let go. This, we have somebody here that is struggling. They're trying to prove something. Uh, they're having a very hard time. It feels like they're really, really getting tired. This person is, is tired. They're tired of, of doing this. They can't, really can't do it anymore. We have somebody here that has reached the point probably of giving up. They're obviously thinking about giving up. They're definitely thinking about it because this is it's too much. They've come a long way. They've been carrying this burden for a long time. Feels like they're really ready. They're ready to just let it go. Or they, they're like, I'm not sure if I can do this anymore. But they don't want to give up. But they may need to give up. It's breaking their back. You know, somebody may be having some back pain because of whatever they're doing. Anyway, there is, I feel like there is some sort of back pain here. Now, they could be working around their home. Somebody could be working around their home getting ready for something. Maybe it's to sell the home. I don't know. And they're working too hard, okay? Because this is about getting a profit. This is about home or who knows what. We we definitely have somebody here that is, is definitely working hard. They're trying to do too much or they are doing, they are, they are doing too much. Um, Queen of Wands reverse. We could be dealing with an Aries, a Leo, Sagittarius. Uh, this person, whoever this person is, is losing their fire. They're losing their flame. They're losing their drive or their ambition. There could be some poor health that is coming. This is not healthy, um, but very, very proud very determined so we have somebody here that is determined to prove something because the this somebody's trying to prove something but it's draining them the need to and this is all about making it look perfect as well somebody's trying to make something look perfect this is like the perfect home the perfect get together the perfect gathering the perfect meeting place you know so it's interesting now this queen of wands and reversed is 
is probably getting weaker. Somebody, and this could be a male or a female. So we have somebody here that is probably getting weaker, okay? Um, but is definitely overly proud. So they are, un, and it's unhealthy. This is an unhealthy uh, carry, okay? This person is carrying weight. They're carrying weight or they're carrying something heavy. It's not healthy. It's not healthy. This person has a self-image problem. They're very worried about how things being perfect as well. We have a perfectionist here, just saying. Um, really wanting to make sure that anybody that looks at them or looks at whatever they're doing sees it as perfect. This is definitely a perfectionist. It is. We have a perfectionist here, which is interesting. But this Queen of Wands in reverse is is, is uh, losing ambition. It's like they they may be sick or something like that. I don't know. Let's see what's going. Getting sick, getting weaker. Um, judgment reverse. This is poor health. This is poor health. It's not answering the call. Not listening to any advice. This is self-doubt. This is guilty. This, or if it has anything to do with guilt, this is definitely not making the right judgment call. We have a person that is not making the right judgment calls because they want to be accepted so badly. This person wants to be accepted. They do. They want to be accepted so badly by their peers or the neighbors or whatever that they just won't stop trying to prove themselves and it's making them sick. Interesting. Anyway, now this is not being accepted, not listening. Very, very, and this is lack of forgiveness as well. This is bad karma, lack of honesty, not being held accountable, not Choosing. This is choosing to not be held accountable. Choosing not to be honest. Somebody is choosing not to be honest or choosing um, not to accept something as it is. I feel like I feel like whoever this person is is not awakened. This person is not waking up. They're not an awakened individual. They're very shallow, very superficial. Everything has to look perfect. Looks are nothing. Looks mean nothing. Oh, but they do to society, right? So, anyhow. Okay, so somebody's not answering the call. They're not being truthful with themselves. They're holding on to their past ways. They can't evolve. They will not allow themselves to evolve, which is interesting. Now, this is not waking up. We have somebody here that is working really, really, really hard. They are definitely overwhelmed. Trying to make everything perfect. Trying to make it perfect. Is This is going to be great. This is perfect. But it's tough. It's very, very tough. This, isn't, this is not being accepted. Really worried. Really worried about not being accepted by their peers. Somebody's really worried about, or by their friends, family, whatever. So we got somebody here that's very, very worried about not being accepted. <laughs> now, the Queen of Wands in reverse is somebody that is. Oh, well, let's get another card before I say it. Ooh, the Tower! Now, the tower reverse, that is trying, somebody has been avoiding upheaval. They've been avoiding collapsing, and they're going to collapse, though. They are going to collapse. You can't avoid it. They, they're going too hard. Somebody is pushing too hard. They're trying to do too much to prove to the outside world, and they're about to collapse. This is a collapse. It is. They've been able to avoid it. 
They have been choosing not to see, choosing not to acknowledge the truth. They're about to collapse. Like you can't avoid it. This is this is a it's it's extremely unhealthy. Okay, reverse tower is extreme health problems. This is a permanent loss. This is something you never saw coming. This is an extreme disruption that was unforeseen. This is a rude awakening. This is it is it is this is a rude awakening here we have we have this person right here that is about to get a rude awakening very very um spiteful feels like this person is spiteful um or just naive if it's not spiteful it could be naive you know but the queen of wands reversed is uh self-righteous this person is self-righteous entitled entitled but there's unhealth this is so unhealthy 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 so we got we have somebody here that is very unhealthy now we could be dealing with a Aries Leo Sagittarius or a Scorpio, male or female. I feel like there could be even, uh, there's some sort of competition here. Somebody has been competing. They've been competing with their neighbors, competing with the people down the street, competing with their friends, competing with society. Uh, but there's going to be an uproar. There's going to be an uproar that causes a major disruption. It's been avoided, but you can't avoid it anymore. This needs to end. Somebody has been able to avoid collapsing. They've been able to avoid an ending. They've been able to avoid it, but they, they can't avoid it anymore because they've reached the point of exhaustion. They have. Um, this is definitely too much. Very unhealthy. I know that I've repeated myself, but this person is very unhealthy. What is this for of wands? This gathering that is coming up. This meeting. Five of wands. <laughs> Jesus, oh girl. Five of wands. That's a battle. That's a competition. It's a fight of some sort. Oh, well, there's going to be a fight at this gathering. Yay! Yeehaw! gonna be a fight at this gathering sounds like a good family event so anyhow be prepared for that one looks like there's going to be a gonna be fun so anyhow um there's going to be a gathering it's coming up and there's probably not going to be um well there could be some fighting at this little get together family get together you know where it's like uh Oh, you know, fun, 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 fun. So anyway, there's going to be a fight at this little hoorah. Prince of Swords. Somebody's going to get out of control. Oh, my God. So, yeah, this is somebody that is clueless, that is negative, that is rude, that is ignorant, that is a know-it-all, that is looking for a fight. So this is going to be great. So, yeah, get prepared for an upcoming get-together where somebody picks a fight somebody picks a fight and this could be this i mean the queen of wands is is revengeful and reversed in reversed she's revengeful she's malicious she's a gossip she or he this is somebody who is manipulative and controlling and melodramatic and throws tantrums and throws fits and whatever likes to be the center of attention i mean we're talking about a fire sign here so it, somebody may be demanding attention. It could be a woman. It could be a man. Um, they're demanding some, and they're gonna get it. Oh yes, they are. They're gonna get some attention, but it ain't positive attention. No sir. Uh uh. Nope. Anyhow, there's gonna be a fight. This is absolutely positively going to be a fight at this little shindig. Okay. So yes, there is. And I feel like things are gonna crumble really, really, really fast. It's gonna, it's gonna come out of nowhere. This, this is gonna come out of nowhere. Um, there's gonna be an event or an incident 
that really is a rude awakening for this person. This person right here is getting a rude awakening. Something is going to be revealed, okay? Some sort of truth is going to be revealed. Now this one can't keep her mouth shut for any reason whatsoever. This is a gossip. It is, just telling you. Okay, this is somebody who can't keep their mouth shut, you know, thrives on drama. This is somebody that is melodramatic. So this drama queen, and yes, this is a drama queen, and I don't care if you like me or not. This drama queen is going to get a rude awakening, okay? Um, could be a male. Males can be drama dramatic as well. So we have somebody here that is creating drama, which is great. Not really. Anyhow, um, somebody's going to, uh, somebody's been carrying a heavy burden. They're overwhelmed. They're exhausted and fed up. And they're going to flip out. Somebody's going to flip out. They are going to flip out. <laughs> Interesting. Whew. Sun reversed. The sun reversed. Now, this is moving very, very, very fast. Somebody may be driving too fast. I'm just changing the story a little bit, but this is moving fast. A six of swords. Somebody's driving. So somebody could be driving too fast. This could be an accident. And yes, I'm going to say it because it absolutely could be. Now, the queen of wands is somebody who likes to go fast. You think about the fires that are spreading. They spread fast. Fire goes fast. Period. So somebody could be driving too fast and they get in an accident. And they don't wake up. I'm being honest with you. Because this is not waking up. Just saying. I know I change the story, but whatever I see, I gotta say. Now this is not happy. This is sad. Could be dealing with a Leo. Doesn't have to be, but this is poor logic, unhealthy, false impressions, false impressions. So we have somebody here that really puts out a lot of false impressions. They may seem like they're healthy. They're not. They are not healthy. Just that. Just be well aware. This person is not healthy. They may be able to project that they're healthy, but they're not. On the inside, they're not healthy. And they're about to collapse. This person is about to collapse. They're overdoing it. Somebody is overdoing it. I think it's a fire sign. Could be a Scorpio, but I don't think so. I think it's a fire sign. I could be wrong. Anyway, um, there's a loss of personal power here. And this person hasn't been honest with themselves or other people. Okay? They haven't. And there's loneliness. There's loneliness due to uh, disillusionment. Okay? There's, there's, there's darkness. We have somebody here that has been in a dark period. But they've been able to... Uh, make others because there's false impressions here they've been able to make others think that they're okay they're not okay they're absolutely not okay this is definitely a, there's going to be a fight at this get together or something like that this is a battle at some sort of get together this person is the Initiator, by the well, this one could be as well. Anyhow, um, it's like this one starts it and this one finishes it. That's what it looks like to me. Anyhow, um, but we also have somebody here that is moving way too fast. This is way, way, way too fast. Driving too fast could be road rage. There could be some road rage here. They're on their way to a get-together, on their way to a gathering. They're overwhelmed. They're in a hurry. They got to they gotta get there. They got to do something, and, you know, they don't make it. You know what I'm just saying? I, I mean, I hope that's not the case, but 
something going on here. Um, this is a fated event that has been avoided for this individual who is very determined. I mean, the Queen of Wands, upright or reverse, is a very determined individual. But this person is depressed and they're not happy and they're not seeing clearly and they're in a deep, dark place. And, you know, they refuse to accept the truth of things. And I feel like this person isn't thinking clearly because they're overwhelmed. And, you know, when you're not thinking clearly, you know, sometimes you don't know where you don't look where you're going. So, you know, somebody needs to be damn careful. Anyhow, um, I have somebody here that is, is really, really busy trying to uh, prove, really, really busy trying to prove that they are somebody that they are not. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Why do people do that shit? We do. We do. Fuck. They're not healthy. Somebody's not healthy. They're, they, they're not healthy at all. And they're about to have a major internal disruption. Or they're about to have a crash. Or something like that. Or crumble. Or collapse. Or whatever. This person is about to get a rude awakening. They've been avoiding the truth. They've been avoiding um, accepting. They don't forgive. There's a lot of when you the the the, the, the judgment reverses lack of forgiveness. This and then for, and when you can't forgive another person, you're bitter. Okay, you're bitter. You're hateful, and that shit festers. So we got somebody here that is very unforgiving and naive. That lives in like this false world. This person's about to get a wake up call of some sort. Shit is about to get real in this person's life. Anyhow, um, they may they may end up working with a team. A team may may need to come and help. They may end up going to maybe that could be like a commitment being committed. Somebody could end up being committed to a retreat. I don't know where that's coming from. I really don't. But, you know, um, this is interesting. Now, there's inner child problems here. Somebody wasn't taken care of as a child, which has caused their self-image problem. And that's where the burden comes from, all the way back from childhood. Somebody's been carrying this burden their whole life, trying to prove, trying to prove themselves to the world. And it's been time to release those old wounds, but they haven't been able to release their old wounds because of the uh, ego. Okay, because of the ego. Anyhow, um... You know, this is, this is going someplace, moving on. Somebody's going to be taking a ride, which we already talked about. They're going someplace. They're on their way. This could be even be driven away, taken away. Somebody could be taken away, taken someplace else. One more card. Five of Cups, this is grieving, separation, loss. So there is, there's, there's, there's going to be a loss. There's going to be regrets. There's a difficult period of he ahead. This is mourning a loss. So yeah, I think that that gathering has to do with a loss. Being honest with you. Um, there's going to be some deep sorrow here. We have somebody that, you know, is probably unstable. They're probably unstable and they're, 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 they reach the point of destruction. 
good luck.